Ragnar Lodbrok's life is shrouded in mystery, as much of what is known about him comes from Norse sagas and legends. According to these accounts, he was born in the 9th century, possibly in Denmark. His father, Sigurdring, was a powerful king and warrior, and it is said that Ragnar inherited his father's fighting spirit and tactical prowess. He grew up in an era when Viking raiders dominated the seas and terrorized coastal towns, and he soon became a renowned warrior and leader of men. As a young man, he quickly gained a reputation as a fierce and cunning warrior, and he soon began leading raiding parties that targeted the coasts of England and France. Legend has it that Ragnar once captured a large snake that was terrorizing a nearby village. He proceeded to tie the snake to the front of his ship and sailed down the river, displaying his trophy to all who saw. When he reached the sea, he released the snake back into the water, much to the amazement and admiration of his crew. This act not only solidified his reputation as a fierce warrior, but also as a cunning strategist who knew how to strike fear into his enemies. Over the years, Ragnar became increasingly skilled at navigating the treacherous waters of the North Sea, and his daring raids brought him great wealth and fame. He is said to have led expeditions as far south as Spain and as far east as Russia, and his ships were feared by coastal towns and villages throughout Europe. Ragnar was a master of unconventional warfare tactics, and he is said to have used everything from disguises and ambushes to feigned retreats and surprise attacks to outsmart his enemies. He was also known for his strategic mind, and he was able to anticipate the moves of his opponents with remarkable accuracy. In one legendary battle, he and his warriors are said to have used a fake surrender as a ruse to launch a surprise attack on their foes, ultimately emerging victorious. Despite his many successes, however, Ragnar was not immune to defeat. In 865, he suffered a major defeat at the hands of the English King Ella, who captured and executed him in a brutal manner. It is said that he was thrown into a pit of snakes, and he died a painful and gruesome death. However, the legend of his death also claims that Ragnar uttered a final prophecy. The young snake will cause the eagle to fall hinting at his son's vengeance. Despite his untimely demise, Ragnar's legacy lived on long after his death. He became a symbol of Viking strength, resilience, and bravery, and his legend inspired countless works of art, literature, and film. In the centuries that followed, his name became synonymous with Viking power and might, and his story became a source of inspiration for warriors and adventurers around the world. Today, Ragnar is remembered as one of the greatest and most legendary figures in Viking history, a man whose daring exploits and fearless spirit continue to capture the imagination of people everywhere. The popular television series Vikings has further cemented his place in popular culture. Ragnar Lodbrok had a large family, and his descendants continued to play significant roles in Viking history. His sons, including Ever the Boneless, Bjorn Ironside, Halfton Ragnarsson and Sigurd Snake in the Eye were all legendary warriors and leaders in their own right. They continued their father's legacy of raiding and conquest, expanding the Viking presence across Europe and beyond. One of Ragnar's grandsons, Harald Fairhair, even went on to become the first king of a united Norway. Another interesting fact about Ragnar Lodbrok is his role in the popular television series Vikings. The character of Ragnar, played by actor Travis Fimmel, is loosely based on the historical figure of Ragnar Lodbrok. The series has introduced many people to Viking culture and history, and has sparked renewed interest in the stories and legends of the Viking Age. While the series takes many liberties with historical accuracy, it has helped to bring the world of the Vikings to a wider audience and has inspired many to learn more about this fascinating period in history.